All right, y'all, so as I mentioned last week, I get a lot of questions about what gig bags fit GOC guitars and a lot of other headless guitars for that matter. And also, as I mentioned last week, GOC Guitars is collaborating with PodTech Bags to bring this new deluxe hybrid tough bag to all of you that are needing a case for your GOC guitars or any headless guitars for that matter. So this is a rugged, semi-rigid gig bag. So it's not one of those floppy, like cheap gig bags that you get with your like starter kit guitars or a lot of the lower price guitars that are out there. This is actually a pretty legit gig bag. It is obviously meant to make sure that it fits GOC's guitars, like the Illumina, the Materia, the Vajra, the Satya, and it doesn't matter whether it's a six, seven, or eight string, I have fit my eight string Materia inside of this, no problem. So it's one bag fits all sizes of headless guitars, honestly. So let's go ahead and talk features. Right? So this military spec ballistic material, it's a fabric, but it's really tough. It's scratch resistant, tear resistant. It helps to keep the bag water resistant as well. Same thing with the zippers here. So that way if you're caught in the rain or somebody spills a drink on it at the venue, you're going to be good, which means it's going to not only safeguard your guitar, but it's also going to last you a long time. You've got ample storage for cables, for guitar picks, for guitar pedals, guitar strings, everything in this front pocket here. One of my favorite features about it though is a little tie down for your guitar cable. So it keeps your guitar cables from getting disorganized or knotted or anything like that. Uh, inside of the soft touch pad, protects your guitar from getting scratched or dinged. It even has a really awesome padded neck restraint, which is especially helpful when you drop it because it keeps the neck in place and makes sure that there's not a ton of extra G-forces and pressure put on the neck. There's also a hidden zippered pocket inside. Now I'm going to stash an air tag inside of it because you know, people tend to suck and stuff gets stolen. Now let's go ahead and see this thing in action real quick. This gig bag holds up insanely well in my testing so far. I've taken it on vacation once and it survived the car ride. It survived a puppy laying on top of it. And it definitely competes with other premium gig bags from brands like Kiesel or Strandberg. I think that this one has a little bit more room than the Strandberg bags. It's just as nice as all of them, to be honest with you. But the kicker is that it's made to fit multiple guitars. It's not just meant to fit one body shape or one amount of string. So this will fit six, seven, and eight in my testing. I don't have anything above an eight string, nor will I. Now on to the information you all wanted to really know. This is going to be launched in a group run, and that's going to be announced very soon. The price is going to be set at $145, which I think is very competitive for what you get out of this gig bag. So you're going to want to stay tuned for the official release date. I will announce that all here, as will GOC Guitars and PodTech. And just keep in mind, from what I've showed you here, this is still the prototype. I gave PodTech and GOC some feedback on this. They're going to take that back and create one more prototype before this launches. The feedback was I recommended there be some extra padding on the side edge here to help if you drop it on its side and also to help it stand up horizontally when you set it down. So like if you're carrying it by the handle and you decide to set it down. They're really great at taking feedback. So if you all ever have any feedback or questions about this, please leave it in the comments. They read all of it and they will take it to heart to make sure that they can make the best product possible before you get to purchase it. So yeah, that's it for now. So feel free to ask me any questions in the comments here and I will be sure to let you all know as soon as this goes live. Peace out, y'all.